Hello and welcome to Notepad++ Beginners Training Course by Alex21 Say. This lesson is all about the two editions of Notepad++, my customized one versus the official one. So let's get started. Let's discuss about my customized Notepad++ edition. My customized edition is nothing but just simple enhancement over the standard Notepad++ edition. It's a hybrid of my custom made settings and extra added features over the standard Notepad++. So what are the things I have customized and added in this edition? First is the preferences settings then the keyboard shortcuts and the code highlighting schema for various programming languages and miscellaneous files like HTML, PHP, SQL and Apache STXS file, VBScript, batch file etc. I like web development and this edition is for robust web development experience. Now, what are the things I have added in this version? This edition of Notepad++ contains custom file icons for various programming languages including but not limited to HTML, CSS, JavaScript and for backend development PHP and SQL. This edition also contains file icons for the miscellaneous files including but not limited to Apache STXS, WAF, log, initialization and error files etc. Along with added customized file icons I have also provided the plugins which includes the multi clipboard plugin, the notepad plus plus exec plugin, the amat plugin and sound and the python script plugins. I have also provided the macros which are written using regular expressions and these are specific for the general programming tasks. Till then I have discussed what I have customized and added. Now it's time to discuss what I haven't modified in this edition. In this edition I don't mess up with the official executable file provided by the Notepad++ official website. So this file is intact and you can have a rich programming experience in my customized edition with the features I have provided along with the official Notepad++ features. Now you have a clear understanding of the changes I have made in my customized edition and it's time for you to decide which edition to go for. In this course I will use the customized version of Notepad++ during the, this entire course and you can have a quick look over the my customized version of Notepad++ and the official one and can decide which one is suitable for you and you can also go for the standard official edition of Notepad++ if you are quite familiar with the interface, its shortcut keys and style and preferences settings. That's all for today's lesson and you can check out more help resources at my personal website or the official Notepad++ website. Have a good one.